Welcome to the tutorial for using EasyBib to help with parenthetical or in-text citations. Often, you will be asked to include in-text citations in your work. These are also known as parenthetical citations. An in-text citation appears in your work directly after you include information you received from another source. EasyBib can help you with the in-text citations. First, navigate to EasyBib by clicking on the link from the Media Center page or going directly there to easybib.com. Make sure to log in using your Chrome email and password or click the sign in with Google button. EasyBib can help you with your in-text citations only after you've cited sources you plan on using in your paper. For example, if we were writing a paper on lemurs, we would have a project called lemurs in our EasyBib account and inside we would have the sources that we plan on using within our paper. Underneath each citation, you will see an option called parenthetical. Clicking this will show you what your in-text citation should look like in your work. If you have a page number, include it, and EasyBib will show you what that in-text citation will look like too. For example, if we are writing a report or essay about lemurs and would like to include a fact that we learned from the book called Lemurs, we must first cite the book. Then we will click on parenthetical. Typically, an in-text citation will include the author and page number from where we received our information. In this case, EasyBib added Throp, the author's last name, for us, but it does not know what page in the book we received our information from. We will need to add that page number in. Let's say we've written the following in an essay. Lemurs will also sometimes eat soil to gain certain nutrients to their diets and help eliminate plant poisons. This fact was found from a book called Lemurs. It was not information we knew already on our own, so we need to include an in-text citation in our essay. This information was paraphrased from page 19 of the book called Lemurs, so we should add 19 to the in-text citation box. Here's what our in-text citation will look like. Then we can either type or copy and paste it into our essay right after the information on lemurs eating soil. We put the in-text citation at the end of the sentence and then conclude the sentence with a period. We must include an in-text citation for direct quotes too, not just paraphrased information. For example, if we include in our essay, lemurs also forage for fruit, which makes up the greater part of their diet, but also eat leaves, flowers, tree bark, and sap. This is a direct quote. We took it from a website that we cited on lemurs. We would include an in-text citation with this information in our essay as well. First, we need to make sure that we've cited the source properly in EasyBib. As you can see here, we have our website cited. As in the last example, we will click on the parenthetical link under the citation that we created. This source is a website and it did not have an author, so we will see that EasyBib correctly tells us to use the article in our in-text citation instead of the author. Websites do not have page numbers, so we cannot add that in. We will simply use quote ringtailed lemur as our in-text citation. We could type this or copy and paste it right into our essay right after the information from the website. We put the in-text citation at the end of the sentence and then conclude the sentence with a period. Keep in mind the point of an in-text citation is to give your reader a reference point. Every in-text citation you include in your essay needs to relate to a source included on your works cited page. This way, a reader knows where your information came from. Let's look at our essay with our in-text citations side by side with our works cited page. In this essay, a reader can see that the in-text citation for the information on lemurs eating soil is THROP19. When the reader looks at the works cited, he or she can find the source that begins with THROP and know that the information on eating soil came from this source. The same thing would happen with the next in-text citation. Looking at the in-text citation, ring-tailed lemur, a reader can look at the work cited and know that the quote on foraging for fruit came from this source. That's it. Remember, when you are writing formally and are being asked for in-text or parenthetical citations, use EasyBib to help you create them properly.